All right, so let's take a look at some of these maps and the way that they're set up. I'm gonna start with Amarish, and I actually wanna warp over to that. Well, well, okay, we'll go over in uh, Amar uh, Azimir first. So I've already done a little bit of recording over on Azimir to begin with, but you can look at the TR and you can see they are massively being destroyed. And there's not a whole lot of places that they can go. They from Watersons, they can try to push out here, but they're probably all surrounded here at Watersons. They need to maximize most of their force. Eli Amp is their only other area, and if they can't do anything, they're kind of screwed there. They could be fighting at Jaeger's Fist, but I'm not sure how their population is. But what I'd like to see is a little bit more of an option to where they can use the terrain to work naturally. So for instance, if you were to use either Bridgeward or Eli, you could push up into East River Station. And if you follow the terrain, it's not hard. You can very easily make that push. And all of a sudden, this becomes relevant if you put a vehicle capture point that can only be captured by vehicles right here. This will also encourage you to build a small little base because now you're also going to want to continue supplying vehicles and tanks to East River without having to drive all the way back around. Let's look at another place. Um, Two Stone Beach. So you can see with this whole bit, you can just kind of follow this river. And this is a nice way that they did it. Frostbite over to Two Stone Beach. And then you go up to Jaeger Crossing. So you got a good amount of fighting that can happen in this area. But here's a problem. This whole bit of the map doesn't get used. Now you'll have this little bit right up in here that might get used. You know, you follow this and come up in here, but a bunch of this becomes unnecessary. Uh, kind of the same thing on the other side of Jaeger Crossing. We'll use kind of up into here. And it can be a little difficult trying to get some vehicles up over here at times. It's not too, too difficult, but a little bit more of a challenge. But if you came across, now all of a sudden you can start hitting Pale Canyon Chemical. That badass way station, I would not put them right up in here, but there's some interesting things going on here and we're not using it. Uh, let's move up the side of the map. So we've got some good flow going on over here because of Advari Biolab and yeah, being able to come over here and then do the cutoff. I like that. No shear, you could get some good vehicle gameplay going on with this whole area, and even if you were to come around the back side, so that's good. There's not a whole lot you can do over here, and this is mostly dead zone. What else do we? That pretty much takes you up to the warp gate. But again, one of the problems that I was saying was Paleo Solar, Crystal Ridge. You'll see Haven Outposts get used all that much, but these two bases are pretty much not really used, and to some extent, even Snowshear. Um, I don't, I don't see fighting in these areas a whole lot because people haven't pushed towards the warp gate nearly as much, uh, especially with the VP system being gone. What else do we have? We got a bunch of interesting fighting that could take place right here, especially because you've got Tap Reservoir that you could go to from Fair Geothermal. You got a nice padded open area. This can provides for some nice uh, defensive zones right here as you're trying to push out towards this base. Again, right here, Manny Fortress. You should be able to go from Manny Fortress right into Stillwater. But look at how big Stillwater is. Honestly, this thing should be cut in half. There should be a vehicle camp point and then right into Stillwater. Still water. Follow the river. It would take you right over to Apex Genetics if you wanted to go for that type of a cutoff. Oh, we're having too much trouble down over here or getting to Stillwater. Let's just cut it off. Especially if you're in a defensive position. And then again, this bit of the map does not get used and I'm going to draw this whole thing out so you know what I'm talking about let me lock that so people will push Manny Fortress sometimes they'll push into North Point I do not see still water get used all that much I definitely don't see gray here on shipping get used at all so it's almost like this whole area is not used for the game 
And that's a significant part of the map, you know? I mean, I would say it's probably 5%, 10% of the map that's just not used at all. It's not it's not really important because people don't really push all the way up into not ant station, not substation, and Great Huron. What else do we have going on? So you have the road here, and it has you go to Prime. But not Eli, even though there's a branch right here. Or not into Sierra Listening Post. This hex is completely messed up and it should have ended right here. And then this would be its own hex. And you get some good armor fights because people will come up this little bit right here. So this whole area does get used. This one is a little bit more of a safe place. But the, again, the road has no meaning. Follow it down. They're a listening post, and oh, look at that. I can't move into not communications because I have to get the thing first. Baron BL4, you should be able to push into geological survey. Natural flow. Natural flow. Now you're guarded here by a mountain. And this can make for some interesting vehicle gameplay, and infantry can kind of camp this area and rain down on them. But when there's not infantry in here, you can just... Pass right in here unobstructed into not research or into geological. Baron BL4, I wouldn't necessarily put one right in here. There is a little bit of a flow, but you start getting caught up in all this nat uh, natural terrain. But then you've got this crash site, and this should be its own area. And you should be fighting over this area. There's some interesting things that you can see. And then natural flow of battle takes you to Eli Forest Pass or even to the Bulwark. And I'm not saying that you need to go to either location or that you need to make it so that both locations are accessible. I'm just saying start stimulating a reason to go into this area, this whole area. I don't see people go to Everett all that much. Sometimes to Frostbite if we get Bridge Ward because we'll go to Old Shore. Stone Beach doesn't get used because Jaeger Crossing, people don't really push from there all that much. Sometimes it does. But there's not really a reason to other than to piss off the person who's at the Southern Wharf Gate. I think that pretty much wraps up as an yeah, as a mirror. I'm gonna move over to Amrish and I wanna demonstrate something. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a second to jump in here and see what I can show you. What about this? All this open area, it doesn't get used. Okay. Now you can see right over here because it's Aoka Chemical. Um, from the tech plant, there's an area you can get in right here. You can kind of curl around right in here and even into Chimney Rock. Right. So I would argue that about this, all gets used. Okay. But then everything above it doesn't. And there's no reason for these to be connected. It just doesn't make any sense. Simulate those open vehicle battles. Just put a capture point right in this location right here. You got a little bit of cover because of the rocks. Or just put it right here because it's in the middle of nowhere. Whatever. Probably right here. And now all of a sudden you can start attacking into decor or to, or to the bastion. Or vice versa, the Bastion can push out if that's where they're being held to. This flow of battle is really nice because you have the mountains. You can kind of push up into here into Ravine Landing, but it's kind of a pain to try and get up this mountain, so I'd leave it as it is. Chimney Rock goes to West Pats, so all of this gets used, kind of. It's like that, pretty much. That portion gets what about all this? Why do you have all this territory here that's not used? You've got some prime vehicle fighting look. If you're coming from a cook watchtower and you start pushing pushing either into West Pass Watchtower or a vehicle capture point which pushes into Chimney Rock, now all of a sudden you've opened up this new area for vehicles to get involved. And I'm not thinking only from the vehicle standpoint. You guys got to remember that infantry is going to be pushing this too. 
it's a hell of a walk to get in here but you've got a little bit of cover right here you've got a little bit of cover here you got some trees people are going to be foot zerging to whatever base they can get up into especially if there's another capture point right here boom boom and then into wherever you want to go not necessarily two moss hummus however people want to say it i'd say two moss uh but then you push into west pass and this whole bit of area gets used then especially because you're going to be making your way to charlie Point. Ah, now we get into one of my favorite spots. Okay, so the tech plant is good. Too much cargo. All of that's good. And that goes into the right locations. Oh, hold on. We've got this road. Why? Why do you have this hexagon right here? One, two, three, four, five, six. So it's a hex, right? That's how hexes work. This is a hexagon. This single hex is part of uh, Roxas Firearms. Why? You should be able to push right up in here. You've even got a vehicle path, a natural path right here. And then what actually annoys me, and which is why I made it all the way over here into enemy territory, you have this whole bit of territory that is not used. None of it. Okay. Now, it can be a little more difficult to get up over here. There is some ways, especially right in here. So it can be a little bit difficult to get to. But what are we doing with it? Like, seriously. And watch. Look at where I'm standing. Right? There's this large open area, which is okay for vehicles. But here's one of those areas that I think Planet Side really shines. My game could be looking a whole lot better. Let me go ahead and throw this off here. Oh, that's what I wanted. There we go. Look at how beautiful this place looks. And we're not doing anything with it. So some places vehicles can get stuck. Some places vehicles can hide. This is even great for infantry because there's a lot of little places they can hide with rocket launchers and stuff. Look at all this shit. This is beautiful. The reason I know about it is because I was hunting pumpkins and found a whole bunch of them here one year. Anyways, those are my thoughts. Battle control terminated.